welcome back to the channel. Welcome to a very productive week as a postgraduate student. I moved out of my dorm room. I don't have a job right now. So I'm just in the middle of adulting and figuring out life. Right now, I am on some sisterly duties. I have to get my brother breakfast and take it to him. So I might as well get breakfast and start this video. Other things we are doing today, I am taking my mom to an event on the coast and we're just gonna have fun. We're just gonna have an adventure for today. Yeah, hold on, let me let me get this first. Oh, focus, it's me. It's me, focus on me. I got, I always get like a chicken biscuit. Massive. I don't know if you can see how, like, how big that is. And then I always get strawberry jelly. I stole my brother's strawberry jelly, but it's fine. Oh yeah, like I was saying, I'm gonna run some errands for my mom today. Tomorrow I have a very important interview. It's not very important, but it is an interview. So I want to practice for that. And then I'll take you guys to the interview tomorrow. But for right now, I'm gonna finish my food, take my mom her food, and I'll probably talk to you guys when we get to our next location. Okay, I just made it to my destination. The drive took like two hours and 10 minutes, 15 minutes or something like that. I see the restaurant that I went to for brunch, but this time I'm gonna go to this cafe. It's called Blue Dog Bistro, I think, and I brought the book. Listen, I have been trying to read this book for the entire month of July. It's August, so we're gonna try again. day and I ran out of bed this morning literally ran outside to check on my plants I put them outside yesterday so they could get some sun but I forgot to bring them in and why did I do that let me show you I don't know who did this but they just chewed on the leaves and spit them out oh look I had four of these okay they just like chewed chewed it down and took them off like do they hate me i don't know what's going on so i'm gonna try to salvage what i can no i'm hurt this is the second plant i've got and i said i was gonna make this one survive but this it wasn't my fault <sighs> let me go to a different spot hold on wait leaving okay this is the best camera angle i could get as of right now but, um, so I collected some of the smaller, the little smaller succulent pieces, I guess, and then I repotted them so they could grow. I already have some growing, so I'm not tripping about it. Um, I do hate that they tore my big one up, but that's okay. That's not what I want to talk about right now. I supposed to go to a job interview today. Later today, I was supposed to drive there. I was going to show you guys my outfit, um, show you guys my presentation that I made, then kind of follow up and show you or tell you about, like, my experience. But I just realized I do not want that job. Like, I just, I genuinely do not want the job. I called the guy yesterday and he was like, um, well, he gave me a better description so I would know what I was getting myself into. And from the sounds of it, it's something that's higher than what I want. And the pay is not there. So I have to go back. I have to send him this email and say, hey, um, I don't know, something professional like that. It doesn't align with what I'm looking for. Basically, just trying to figure out a nice way to tell him I'm not coming to that interview. Like, I didn't even do the presentation last night. So, that's where we are in life right now. This was supposed to be like a productive kind of vlog. But right now, I don't know what to do next. I I, I don't know what to do next. So, I'm going to go in here. I'm going to bring my plants inside. I'm definitely going to bring my plants inside. I'm going to send the email first. Take a shower. And kind of do a little bit of life searching right now. And I'm going to come back later. And you guys will see where we are and what we're doing. biggie bag with the, the chicken BLT something like that mm. and then a pineapple mango lemonade so you know how I said I was gonna email the recruiter not the recruiter but the guy let me tell you what the what my email said I said that 
I would like to withdraw my interest from the interview. After considering the job position in its entirety, entirety, I am afraid it does not align with what I am looking for at this time. I truly appreciate your time and consideration. I am more than honored that you considered me for the position. Wishing the best of luck to you and your team to find the perfect candidate. Best regards. And then he replied while I was on the road. He said, um, thank you so much for letting me know. Good luck with your future plans. It has been nice getting to know you. Hopefully we will meet up at some point in the future. I don't know why I was so nervous to send that email, but like I was not going to be a good person for that job. Well, that job was not gonna be a good thing for me. The job that I really want is in Charlotte, North Carolina. And it's a universe, it's at a university. And right now they're like busy with like moving students in, getting them set up to start the semester. I'm gonna say this why he hasn't replied to my email yet, but I need to call him and ask him like, what's the move, what's going on? <laughs> Ashley. My life just feels really stagnant right now and I keep telling myself like it's okay it's normal like everything isn't always supposed to line up one thing after the other I haven't I don't have an apartment yet I don't have an actual job yet I just right now I'm just playing the waiting game I'm just living life and breathing air I'm gonna go back to my friend's place I don't know I just it's always good vibes with my friends so I'm gonna go back to her and then tomorrow morning I think I'm gonna leave and go to Memphis not Memphis but it's in the surrounding area just to go see family like I have nothing but time on my hands I don't know if I'm going to do like another travel vlog or like a road trip kind of vlog or just incorporate it into this one you guys will see when we get there to that point in time I low-key want to set up a dentist appointment for when I get back because my back teeth now I get cavities easily. I don't know why I brush like I'm supposed to. I floss, but I just get cavities very easily. It could be another one or it's time to take my wisdom teeth out. I still have both of my wisdom teeth. <laughs> It does match me. I should have gotten this one. This one is matcha with the brown sugar boba. Mmm. Give me back my <laughs> That's good. Today is Friday, and I think this is the final day I'm going to include for this vlog. Simply because I don't know what's going on right now. I want to do a separate like travel vlog, so I'm going to stop it off right here. But anyway, look at me. Focus. Okay, I'm headed to the dentist. I don't know if I told you guys this before, but I was supposed to go to the dentist Monday, but they called me yesterday like, oh, um, the hygienist is not going to be here Monday. You could either come tomorrow, which is today, or you could come August 31st. And I'm not waiting till August 31st. So I'm just going to go to the dentist right now and I'm going to let them do an x-ray. I hope it's not time to remove my wisdom teeth because I'm not trying to have that bill right now. No, I don't want my teeth to fall out either. So yeah, I'm going to go here. And then I'll talk to you guys inside. I can't like record, record inside, but I can show you like a sneak peek or something of what the office looks like. That did not take nearly as long as I thought it would. I only get one free x-ray per year with my insurance, so I couldn't get an x-ray. She said she didn't think anything was wrong or needed like further work, so she just prescribed me a, some kind of fluoride toothpaste, and I have to use Sensodyne. And hopefully that's gonna resolve everything. But listen, I'm just trying to get all this stuff together before I move. Well, if I do move, I don't even know if I'm going to move yet. I emailed the guy, cause like, what's going on i'm trying to figure out if i have a job sir <laughs> i'm trying to figure out if i have a job and he's playing with me so anyway my next appointment is going to be february i hate when they ask you like oh what day are we thinking babe 
It's literally six months away. You think I'm gonna know where and what time I wanna be here in six months? I don't know. But yeah, I'm glad she doesn't think anything's like seriously wrong. So I'm gonna test out this new toothpaste. I had to do it for like a few months, she said. So we're gonna see and hopefully, hopefully I don't need my teeth out or I don't have any more cavities, we'll see. <laughs> welcome back um i am currently lost right now i thought i would be able to give you guys an update on the whole job thing in north carolina but i have not received any emails yet and i'm ready to end this video so i'm going to end this video today is monday august 14th and i think the last thing i want to do for today all right i broke my phone okay this is my old iphone 13 the back was already broken but the real problem is the screen does not work okay so i got my insurance i got a new phone none of like my recent pictures or videos are on my icloud why does icloud you go back to the oldest stuff and i feel like they get all the unnecessary stuff i tried so hard to like get back in and connect my phone and see what pictures and videos i could get off but it's just gone babe my messages are gone my uh, it's gone so you know we live and we learn now i'm gonna definitely back up my like get a bigger storage i guess for this one i don't know also i am a little bit crusty simply because i've been awake right but i've been like planning my day and seeing how I want this next vlog to go. I've been crazy. Like I've been filming like vlogs back to back to back and hopefully they're really good. Okay. This is sealed. I just need to go put it in the post office. I mean, put it in the mailbox. Oh my goodness. I did put the flag up on the mailbox. So we're good to go for that. And bestie, unfortunately, this is where I'm going to stop this video so I can get started for my day. If you're interested in seeing what I do for the rest of today, um, I'm going to create a vlog called spend a day with me in Tennessee or something of that nature. It's going to be a few vlogs into the future. So what I would do if I were you, I would go down below, hit the subscribe button and then hit the notification bell right next to it. So you're notified every time I upload another video. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more content like this, where I try to figure out my life, then go down below and let me know, hit the like button. But anyway, peace. I'll see you in my next upload.